three, two, one. Big Doug, a Gloucestershire-based storage solutions company with a big personality. Where else in the world of shelving would you find a local company that strives daily to put the fun into functional? Its humble beginnings began back in 2004 and is now part of a global business group. Still humble in their approach, Big Doug employees are down to earth, dynamic, innovative and committed to providing the best experience for their customers. But don't be fooled, it isn't all about boring old shelving, no offence shelving lovers. Recently we've seen the company decorate its building as a giant advent calendar, gift Christmas in a box over the 24 days of advent to families in need, design and deliver a ruby encrusted wheelbarrow to Nars off of Love Island, raise over £4,700 for a local charity Heart Heroes, interview Michaela from The Apprentice and employ Tom Malone Jr as a chair tester. It goes on and on. Big Doug is busy. This episode will introduce you to a small collection of Big Doug employees. Let's start with our incredibly hardworking customer services team. Hey guys, I just thought I'd show you kind of coming into work right from the start. So, getting in this morning, hand sanitizer, and then leave herself in. And then what we do is every morning we've got to check our temperatures, um, write it on the list. I can't do both, I haven't got my tripod, so I'm gonna turn you off and then I'll show you what it's like to walk in and everything. So just coming in and then I'm gonna turn you around. Oh, the stairs. Morning guys. Oh yeah. Um, it's not, yeah, it's not, um, it's okay. um, So basically, I am customer service team leader and um, I just thought I'd kind of go briefly over what, what I do and what the team does. Normally, day to day, I'll come in and make sure the calls are answered, make sure orders are getting popped through, make sure all tasks are complete. Um, what else do we do? I make sure, um, there's cover when people are on holiday. We've got morning and late shifts, so they need to be covered. Back to work, so if someone's been off. Um, yeah, obviously assisting training. If you had caught me last week, you would, or the week before, we would have been doing one-to-one, -one, so I'll get the stats for each team member, call stats, sales, book in their meetings, and then we'll go and sit, sit through all that. Um, make sure have, have a chat. Have a bit of a laugh, have a chat, make sure everyone's happy. This is me blogging right now. <laughs> Adele and Jordan. We love a Monday. How do you seem? Oh, it's not touch screen. Yeah, who's calling, sorry? This is a Monday morning at 11.17. Yeah. 158 calls. Um, so this week, what we've done is we've um, changed the task. So each person's... A, I'm rambling on, but each person, along with taking the calls we take and their general admin, their own inboxes, we um, each person has different tasks. So you'll have someone doing um, refunds, you'll have someone doing um, live chats, someone is on the main contact inbox, um, putting orders on, chasing um, out of stocks, making sure our customers are aware if we've got any stock issues all sorts of tasks so what we do is we like to mix it up and make sure everyone is fully trained so um we've changed them all around myself and my manager kate my amazing manager kate have decided to get everyone on different tasks so this week i'm going to be along with the help of my other colleague emily we're going to be training everyone make sure make sure everyone's comfortable on their new tasks ready to go on monday next week so that's what we're kind of doing this week amongst the busyness of calls we're hitting you know four or five hundred calls a day admin is crazy busy but it's a really good problem to have so um the team is smashing it as always and we're getting everything done so my name is jack hayman i work as a ppc executive within the e-commerce team here at big doug so one of the things I've been really focused on the first few months is making a good first impression. I think it's so important as with any new... 
I'll have to do that bit again. So it's been a brilliant 2021 so far for Big Doug and since joining in January I've only got good things to say about the business and the people within the business. It's been a great start for myself as well in terms of getting integrated within the team and being part of the Big Doug family. So I'm delighted to have joined and really started to hopefully contribute to the business. So today I'm primarily focused on Amazon. I'm currently building out a Amazon campaign so this is for one of our products that we sell exclusively on Amazon. So I'm currently focused on building the keywords out for this campaign. So I'm building a keyword list, which we can then add bids to. Once we add the bids, we then tell Amazon how much we're willing to pay for one click. And then if a user does click on our advert, then we pay Amazon. And then hopefully by the user clicking on this product, we then see a sale. So today I also got told that I look like a lemon. I'm not really sure what that was about or why they called me that. And I'm not gonna say which member of the team it was, but pretty harsh, I thought. Morning. So today we are filming our April Fool's Day video. Oh, that's my boyfriend in the background. He's not really reckons this gorilla pod is his, but <laughs> I don't think it is. I think it's mine. It's definitely not. Anyway, so we are going um, to the warehouse today and we are filming a April Fool's video. So just arrived at the studio. Uh, the weather isn't looking that great. As you can see, it's a bit rainy. So the percentage drops quite a lot in about an hour's time. So we're hoping that the weather is going to change. But meanwhile, um, I'll introduce you to the team. So here's the guys. Morning. Morning. This is James and Jane, all on the design team, the dream team we are. <laughs> so yeah, we're busy planning for today. Um, so yeah, lots of fun to come. So the first job is I'm going to build a little mini bay and then we're going to see if we can find a bigger bay. And the whole idea of today is basically we're going to try and shoot and edit an April Fool's advert all in one day. Um, and the advert is a spoof advert obviously because it's April Fool's. Um, and we are going to be um, pretending that we offer a VIP helicopter service. So right now Polly over in Gloucester in her home is writing um, the copy for the interviews and we are going to film some of the cutaways uh, and then later on I'm going to stand to airport to film with aid our business services uh, sales team and uh, he's going to do a piece of camera as our voice of authority. So these are our really 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 cute mini bays. This is the shell for the mini bay. Uh, these are the side beams. <laughs> uh, so we need to try and find a big shelf that matches these. Oops. Uh, so that's also going to be a mission. Okay, so moment of truth. We're going to build a little mini bay. Um, I've never built one before. So it would be really embarrassing if I can't build it. So this is our customer service advisor, Adele. you've been here now? Um, since July last year. And she is flashing it. So this is Kim. He is a reseller coordinator. He's, been, he's been with us for how long now? Just over two years now. Two years. And yep, he's smashing it too. <laughs> so this is Sam. So we got Sam. She is a customer service advisor and she has been here for how long now? Yeah, a year. Yeah. And she is also smashing it, as is everybody. <laughs> Say that again, Alan. <laughs> so this is Jordan, he is also a customer service advisor and he has been here for a year. For a year, yeah. Say hi George. Hello. Hi, George. And as with everyone, he's smashing it. Jane, <laughs> what are you doing? Um, my job is very weird. Today I'm ironing a fancy dress. <laughs> Toilet sinks, <laughs> of all things. 
That's it. <laughs> and not very well on mustache. <laughs> so next challenge is to go and find some steel. And I heard, I've actually got some steel, but if there was thinner steel, I think that might be better. It's not the best. And then hook. So, uh, yeah. It is so busy. 362 calls, hundreds of emails, lots of purchase orders. But we're still training in between. It's going well. We have training commencing next to me for roofing training as we have new tasks um, across the team. So at the minute we have Georgia and uh, Georgian training on refunds and returns. Be back in a minute. Good morning everybody. Uh, it's Luke from Big Doug and today I am at Gloucester Rugby King's home. I've got my mask and my top on. So we are one of the main sponsors for Gloucester Rugby and I'm here today to spend some time with the Gloucester Rugby team, uh, to meet their new head of partnerships and kind of just go over everything that we've been working on and everything that we're going to plan to come up over the next few months. Um, obviously as the world comes back to normal, which is exciting. Uh, they've been playing matches um, throughout COVID, obviously in a very safe way, but as May approaches which is very fast, they will be back um, in the proper stadium with fans. So we're just here to talk about all things partnerships. Uh, I'm in a box today, one of our boxes, uh, and uh, we have a nice view, which is lovely. There's no one here. It's nice to have and been looking at not at the same four walls that I have done for the past year. I'm sure Jane agrees. And the we are here on the 20th, what's the date today? 31st. 31st of March, so for everybody watching this, remember these two were the hottest days in March, 30th and today. So it's beautiful, as you can see, look, I don't know whether the screen's gonna adjust. It looks overcast, but it's not. It's all nice and blue and, and very bright today. So we're having a nice day. Um, you can see that we've got Big Doug here. Boop, boop. And uh, we've also done the tunnel, but the tunnel is on this side, you can't see it. It's down there. So we design this. <clears throat> As we all know, most important thing about work is the coffee breaks. If you don't know about beanies, nutty hazelnut, get to know about it. Awesome. Also, is it completely obvious that my dad got me this mug? So now I've just downloaded some Amazon reports as another key aspect of this role is the ability to report on our performance. So I've downloaded this data in order to see how we're performing month to date and just whether anything needs any optimizing, whether we need to look at any campaigns, how the keywords are set, if everything's okay and working as it should be. I'm trying to work out whether it's socially acceptable to do a video call outside because this weather is absolutely unbelievable. Right now I'm just preparing for a video call with one of our external agencies to go through our Amazon performance for the month of March. So we've managed to find a shelf which looks the same. Um, so that's really great. Uh, it's got wheels on but that's all right, it doesn't matter. We hopefully won't notice that. They've wrapped it um, and now we're going to wrap the little mini bay and also put some steel on which is what I've been out doing. I've been getting some steel so it looks like we've got steel ropes. So there's a mini version and then a larger version um, which looks pretty funny. Uh, yeah, it's just coming together nicely. Guys! Oh, the idea the shot. <laughs> <laughs> Were you in the shot? I didn't mean to. <laughs> <laughs> Do you reckon you did that? Yeah! <laughs> 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 she really wants to be on camera. <laughs> Here's Matt, our uh, actor. Hello! <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Matt's our pilot for the day, aren't you? I am. I'm going to get the aviators on in a minute and we're going to fly. <laughs> <laughs> and then this is our mini bay. We managed to get that sorted with our little tiny hooks. 
and it's like super cute and then we've got a big version. Right, so uh, we're getting there now. We've got the camera set up um, and uh, I don't know what she is. Uh, what are you? Traffic ball short. <laughs> it's, uh, she's just learning how to be an air traffic marshal. <laughs> 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 this is uh, obviously the blades of the helicopter. <laughs> seven and it's April 1st and we are launching our April Fools uh, we are just waiting for it to tweet uh, it's up on Facebook we decided this year that we were gonna offer helicopter delivery for showering which obviously is very far-fetched and, and um, clearly not doable flying a shower bay through the air but we did it uh, and it's launching right now um, I know Polly is getting ready on her end to start selling in the press um, but we're just getting it all up on social uh, and getting it, all the ads done. And then tomorrow we're going to launch the reveal, which is a really silly video um, of behind the scenes making it. But I am up early to get everything up and ready on social media um, and watch all the comments come in. Um, hopefully it gets some good pick up and people find it funny. Obviously it's April 1st, you can never know with these things. Uh, but yeah, so we've never done anything like this before. Uh, when we kind of started revamping the brand a couple of years ago, we were a million miles away from, from ever being able to do a, um, a April Fool. Sorry, making a cup of tea at the same time, it's early. 
uh, yeah, we were a million miles away from being able to do an April Fools, but well, this year we thought we can do it. We're, we're the brands at a place where people know about us enough and know our sense of humour. So we've done an April Fools. So let's just go on social media. I personally think yellow is a great colour. I'm not scared to be criticised for it. We currently have a socially distant interview, second interview. So um, at the moment, Emily is talking through what we do and things like that. So I'm going to go over there. I'm not going to take you with me, but I'm going to go over and check in on him. It has been so busy. There's been no missed calls, which is amazing. And admins finally up to date on a Wednesday, which is great. Um, yeah, it's been a good day, but it's been a very busy day. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button.